Hello guys, welcome back of course. And here I am. I fueled up. All ready to go. Seven o'clock in the evening. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. School bus, thank you. Thank you, good sir. You were really nice to me. I love it. Let's get back on the road I need to take. Let's get the show on the road, as they say. Let's, let's put it like that, but for me, if I, I go to America, it's for an NBA game. 
that would be fantastic. But uh, quite expensive, over 1,000 euros, and then you need money, of course, to uh, do something there. So you're gonna take 600 euros extra. Whee! Too expensive. <laughs> but you know, uh, now I'm in America. I have to work. But that's the good thing about having your own company and being the boss of that company, and so far being alone in that company. Uh, I can take a day off. <laughs> you know, I can say, well, you know, the game is on Friday, okay, I'll do my last job on Thursday, and then, you know, the Friday uh, I'll take uh, I'll take off. It's just uh, what you want, of course. And that's, uh, I had that uh, in school also, of course, uh, you know. I was in a class, wanted uh, to be carpenters, you know, to work in construction. I did not really have the dream, but you know, because of my friends, you know, my cla well, classmates, my friends, were talking about, you know, oh, we're going to start our own business, and you know, then we can we make money, and we hire people, and then we can lay back a little bit, you know, you get into that idea. But then I had a job where I have to, uh, you know, have to help uh, carpenters and people with their uh, own companies. You know, they get a ticket at front, they come in the back to me, uh, they gave me the ticket, I see the materials and I'll get, I get them from, you know, for them, put them in the van and they help me with the heavy things. You know, and uh, some, uh, some of the clients work for themselves, you know, they have their own company, they work alone, or they have two or three people, but same thing. You know, and I asked, you know, uh, you get talking and they say, Oh, uh, you want to start your own company? I said, no, back in the days, because we all thought, you know, big big money, uh, we hired two, three people, let them work, we stay, you know, all day home, having fun. And he says, yeah, 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 that's what you think, but that's not the case, dude, if you have your own company, especially, you know, for the first five years, you don't have money to hire anybody. So you have to do it alone. Uh, so you work from, let's say, eight o'clock in the morning to five o'clock in the evening, you know, you go home, but, you know, then you have your paperwork. And I'm like, oh, paperwork? I, he says, yeah, you know, if you work for a boss, they have other people, but if you work alone, you know, you have to do taxes, you have to call customers, uh, if something goes wrong, you have to talk to them, you know, you have to put everything right, so, you know, he says, when I'm home, first thing I do is I take a shower, I take a little bit to drink, and I do my paperwork, and then at 10 o'clock in the evening, I'm done. And I'm like, ooh, and he says, yeah, you know, and one hour later, I'm in bed, because I start at 7 in the morning, so it's it's not all, you know, what you think of it, so that was, of course, uh, a little wake-up call. You know, that's where many people go wrong, of course. They think having their own business is, you know, good, and it is good, don't get me wrong, but they, some people uh, want it for the wrong reasons, you know, they think, well, yeah, I thought so, I'm, <laughs> I'm too quick, I'm too quick, oh, I'm already there, fantastic, that's quick, damn, really, 30 kilometers to go, and I need to sleep in, oh, that is perfect, time flies, dudes, when you're having fun, you know, so, some people, uh, like I said, you know, uh, we were young, we were like 18 years old. So we all thought, uh, well, we're gonna start our own business, you know, and then hire two or three people, let them work, we get the money, mm -hmm. and we have fun. No, it's not gonna be like that. <sighs> and of course, uh, I thought about... Uh, know being a truck driver because I uh, I see it on TV you know and I have quite the heavy job you know uh, physical it's really really demanding and then uh, you look uh, to a movie or you know something uh, a 
uh, a documentary about truck drivers and you see them driving and you think, huh? You know, they sit in a truck driving all day. That's not too bad. <laughs> you know, yeah, that's really what I thought. I thought mm, they don't have a hard life, you know. But then, of course. <coughs> That's of course totally wrong. Wow. <sighs> I have something in my throat. Don't die, Kruger. Because he's gonna do that guy. He's gonna do CPR on me. Don't want that. I don't want him to kiss me. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yeah, let's be smart about this, right? I can show off to you guys, but. already in there or at least very very close because a good start is half the work this is not a good start right okay what I'm not sure yeah, this is not Well, it's a good start, don't get me wrong. This is better, this is better. Ooh. Am I gonna make it? I'm not sure. I'm going to hit the wall with my truck, I'm not sure. Just a little, you know. The question is, can I pull it back? Not really. Nope, not really. Okay, I went a little bit. It was beautiful, but a little too sharp. Let's try that. Accept it. Bang, there we go. Nice. Great job. 600. Yeah, that pulls it right. That pulls it right. Oh, ooh, look at XP. Damn, that's great. If I can, can fight another job. Mm -hmm. But first, we need to sleep, of course. Now, did I see a place to sleep? It's 12 o'clock. Oh, that's great to sleep, because then I start at 8, 9 in the morning. Could I not sleep here? I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Not too fast on these tramples. The speed bumpies. Ooh, damn. 15%. Well, the truck is still going, so I'm not gonna repair it now. Oh, here I can sleep. I discovered this one already also. Um, yeah, you know, we could get a job here or another job here, so. But let's put a waypoint there. I need to sleep in. That's no problem. No problem. 12 kilometer drive. Nothing coming there, nothing coming there. So, uh, easy peasing. You know, I don't have to rush it. Because I really need to sleep. Oh, dude. It's gonna start raining. Put the wipers on, or else I'm gonna get a ticket for that. You know it. Alright, and then we can find another job. <sighs> and I need 500 XP, but the, I need. Um, for a shorter job, I get 300 XP, so. You know, no worries. I 
don't I don't need to rush it. I can do uh, two jobs of around 380 kilometers, that would also be good. And then I make it to level 9 guys. Higher and higher we go. <laughs> Very sharp on giving somebody a speeding ticket. <sighs> That's how I see it. I'm sorry. No respect, dudes. No respect for the cars. Alright. To the left, the motel. One star. That's not good. <laughs> um. Yeah, it's weird, because the only way I can activate it is if I go like this. It's, it's really weird, but look, bang, how weird is this, right? So guys, let's go to sleep, and I'm gonna find a good job for us, and in the next video we're gonna deliver it, of course. And uh, hopefully, hopefully, make, nah, not after, after two jobs, level 9. And that's great, of course, so see you guys later. Keep rocking, dudes.